everyone, I'm Kirsty, and today I'm going to be reacting to Astro, Moonbeam and Sanha's Who? That is a mouthful. <laughs> So this is gonna be a first react, first time reaction for me because I've not. Well, I don't think I've ever watched like the the duo of Mumin and Sanha. I've watched a couple Astro things, but not a whole lot. Um, I've liked a couple of their songs. Um, I've not really done a deep dive into them or anything like that. So if you want to leave any recommendations for B sides or title tracks that you think are just like really great, um, I'd very much appreciate those because I. Um, don't really know a lot about Astro. Um, I've liked a couple of their songs. I think I liked the song they released was like August last year. Don't ask me what it was called. <laughs> I just remember, I think I liked it. And then I also liked the stuff, they had a song with LDN Noise and LDN Noise are one of my favorite producers. So um, I liked that in the past. I'm excited to see my thoughts and feelings on this and if I'm gonna find a new, a new thing to love. Um, if you enjoy my reaction, don't forget to hit subscribe. If you'd like to leave a like or a comment, I'd very much appreciate that. Is that a confession box? Oh, oh, it is a confession box. Okay. Oh my, oh my God, this religious imagery? I like his voice. Drop is so short. I feel about that <laughs> that very much oh I can definitely like you can see why that's like a a unit song rather than like a full group song like it's very oh I, I don't know how to describe that but it it's a very interesting sound and very interesting song I feel like I need to listen to that a few times um I think the major thing that stuck out to me was how short it felt like it's, it clocks in at about three minutes, just over three minutes. And like, I'm kind of used to that nowadays because a lot of, a lot of, um, 
a lot of songs these days are like two and a half to three minutes because the shorter the song the more streams you get um but i felt like the chorus what it, or the drop the the chorus drop whatever that was was just so short i would have liked to, to go a little bit longer maybe had like a kind of vocal part of it um so that you could like really bathe in the sound um if you know what i mean um I really like the end part where it was just like kind of fading out and like this this singing that was just like it, it felt kind of how do you put it it felt off-putting but not in a bad way but like in a, like a because the song itself is kind of a bit creepy and kind of a bit like off kilter um the outro I felt like really worked in the position that it was in you know I felt like it was kind of leaving you like off foot is that the word it's off foot or what like you just like just like oh if you know what I mean because the song itself is like a really creepy sound but it's not like it's not like horror creepy it's more just like because of like the, the uh, I don't even know how to describe this I feel like the way there's the all the religious imagery in the music video and then the kind of the the dark sound of the song just kind of leaves you feeling a bit like I don't even know. I don't know how to describe this. I don't have the words for it. But like I don't know, it was just really interesting. I'm definitely glad I checked it out. I wouldn't say it's a song that's gonna enter my like repeat playlist because I have a playlist that's like eight hundred plus songs that are just like bangers for my car um but it's definitely something i'd go back and like watch again and listen to again and maybe watch the stages because it feels it almost it reminds me a lot of both paradise lost by gain and then also monster by um uh, red velvet irene Suzuki. like both the imagery and the kind of darker sound to it that feels just off kilter um it definitely has that and it's very much a performance heavy song um so i'm interested to see it on stages um to see the full choreography um the music video was actually stunning like i loved that music video it was just like i felt like the lighting was perfect the 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 vibes were just like immaculate for like what it was trying to portray the guys were looking beautiful and stunning and handsome um and the beauty shots were fantastic um yeah and i feel like the work they did with like shadows and stuff was really great as well um i don't know a whole lot about video stuff but those are just the things that kind of struck me um but yeah definitely an interesting one wasn't what i was expecting thank you so much for watching my socials are linked down below i hope you have a great rest of your day goodbye